I knew it was something really juicy, but I, I can't... I can't see anything that's terribly effective for this. I'll go for... I want to go for a chain lightning. Why can't I do that? Not enough action points. I'll go for an electrical... No, what's the other one? Let's see... Oh, it's Daisy Bolt. I'll just go for an electrical discharge on him. See if I can get the kill. Ouch! And they set me on fire. Tis but a scratch, my lord. Phoenix dive. Who cares about the fire? Fire is not a problem. And let's go for an all-in. Let's get rid of that guy's armor. Smack. Miss. That was uh, not fair. Let's go for the elemental arrows. We'll have cursed fire arrows. Is that right? Or fire arrowhead. And we'll go for the barrage on him. Oh, he's, I nearly got him. Nearly got him. Let's move out of the fire. Oh, I'm slowed as well, so this might not work. Just. And then I think we will withdraw from the fire for a moment. <laughs> don't, don't go running in there, Fred. That's just going to make a mess. Are these worth trying to nick stuff from? Probably. I think I can get away with this. The thing I have to not do is then once I'm on fire, run into that poison up there. Well, that could have been a lot worse. A lot worse. I do feel sharp rocks. I feel like they're important for something. I just don't know what. What does this do? I wonder what this does. That's probably better off not as I've broken it. The device breaks in a cave and nobody's around to complain. <laughs> Did I really break it? That is a very good point. <laughs> it wasn't me, Governor. 43 magic armor. Warfare and hit points, I like. I don't think it's uh, I don't think it's any better. Okay, I'm going to guess that this cavern here just comes out down the bottom. Let me have a look over over this way. See if there's anything I've forgotten, missed, or otherwise lost. I might as well pick these up because they don't seem to weigh enough to be a problem. And at some point, I might suddenly find a use for all those jelly shrooms. They sound nice, don't they? I would buy a bag of, of uh, Haribo jelly shrooms. They sound really nice. Oh, chicken. Stop! Danger! Don't go! B -b bad bird! Hanging from a branch with its wings spread wide and a terrible squawk! Don't go! Don't go! That sounds like a shrieker. Birds down here, that's what it's talking about. Great big screeching bird. There it goes. It doesn't even hop down to see the bop bop bodies. Do you have any eggs to spare? The hen gives you a panicked nod. <laughs> I don't know if I can uh, take on it. I, do I Majesties, have? be under no illusion. Quick work is imperative to our success. The Lady Dallas commands no less for this important dig. I don't think I have got... Um... Oh, what the hell have I just gone through? Can't reach there. Yeah, that's okay. Um... I don't know what I can do to get rid of that then. Galvanised. 
In vulnerable to regular damage, they can be destroyed. Oh, by source vampirism. The thing is, okay, so I can do that, so that's like purge. I don't know if I could get close enough without getting nuked. I don't know. Just, uh, I'm gonna need to borrow you a minute to your beastie boy. A dead worker with a key. Was there not another key? There's another key over here. Lucky find. Colleagues, it's come to my attention that some workers have been slacking off. This is unacceptable. Their pace must be increased if we are to satisfy the Lady Dallas's bidding. Do not make me bring painful incentive into the equation. Raymondo. This page. The page's note has been written on is covered in vulgar doodles that the caption suggests depict said Lady Dallas and Magister Raymond in some unorthodox ritual positions. I see. I wonder if I could sneak in. Do you know, actually, that does have... If I put C on... That's the only place that's looking. So I want, I think I can actually get past that. Does that move? Let me just save here in case this doesn't work. Is that... Oh, void. It is a shrieker. It is a shrieker, but it's only looking in certain directions. What the hell is that? The the risk with this is that I don't notice something else sneaking up from another direction. Right, we've got around. And boom. Job done. Nice, okay. Nice indeed. What's this? Amulet of Paradise. Strength, bartering, leadership, and lucky charm. You know, that does sound pretty good. Anything down there? Uh, potentially. Okay, let's, let's put the party back together. Check this thing out. And it looks like we're heading down that way. But we also... Let's, let's just take a look over here. So I don't know if that's going to be accessible gear please is that better than what i've got oh without a doubt that is the thing to use let's put a rune in that as well we have got critical chance plus five percent or maximum magical armor let's go for crit chance i really like crit chance it's one of my favorites five percent crit chance forty percent We're boosting that still with the uh, two-handed skill. Whoops, whoops. I need to put the wrong thing on. Right, now we're over. Is there anything to... There is. Save, because I want to see where this takes us. It's put me in another part of this. Oh, a dead end? I didn't activate... I don't think I need to, but I didn't activate that waypoint down there. Malachite... The sharp rock. Okay, I'm going to have to find out what, what I do with that. Silver ring. Huntsman and pyrokinetic. Mm, I'll keep the earth resistance and summoning, I think. Oh, no, huntsman. Huntsman. Nah. There will be some better stuff for Beast eventually. There will. We'll get him a better ring eventually. This looks similar to the other relic I found. I wonder if it has a similar effect. The towering relic seems to hum with esoteric energy, faintly pulsating in time with the beat of your heart. You feel it drawing you closer, yearning for your touch, hungering for your source. Back away from the relic, because this is a job for Fane, I think. Before you lies the hulking, broken ruins of eternal technology. It's familiar, but after so long feels strangely alien too. Despite the damage, you can make out the faint pulse of esoteric energy. A pulse that quickens as you approach. Reach out and lay your palms upon the stone. As your palms press into the warm stone, you feel the depths of your being crack open. <laughs> your power flows from you into the relic. 
yet a reverse current flows back into you with a new power, a different power. I read that as uh, you feel the depths of your crack open. Well, I, skeletons might, I don't know. No, let's not go there. The stone warms and warms until it is suddenly too hot to touch, forcing you to remove your hands and step back. Eternal armor could be very useful. Very useful indeed. So I have a feeling that I haven't actually done that on the first one. Fane's got nothing there, but it's, this is a set, right? So let's go and look at, at Fane for the companions. Make a break. No. Nope. No, it's this, is it? Right. Eternal relics in the Black Pits. Fane's people were here and he may find answers. Search the Black Pits. Okay, that's as far as that one goes. It's just when Beast said, this reminds me of that other relic I found. I don't remember if I did anything with it with Fane, and if I haven't, it's probably too late now. I'm sure it would have flashed up, though, wouldn't it? It would be on the quest if it was, so... Yeah, it was, it was lucky coming in this little bit here. I've done it. It's horror reference. I don't know my horror films and stories, so I'm afraid I have no idea what that is. We can we leave? Well, we can. We'll just, we'll just do this. Not the biggest teleport in history, but he gets us across. Oh, HP Lovecraft. All right, we've found some stuff and some things. Let's check out the, uh, we've already looted that. Make sure we've got this activated. The statue looms in the shadowy darkness as the tears dampen your f Nice. I do like the um, little bit of story with, the, with those things. So we're going down to the depths, are we? Well, Beast is off on a little rampage first by himself because I think there's stuff to find here. <laughs> that suit of armor is so good. I look forward to getting uh, Fane's armor. I love the uh, the individual quest armors Carved and stuff. from unfamiliar metal in an alien style, this mysterious object yet glows with a pulsating inner light that is familiar to you. The unmistakable brilliance of Source. Aha. So if I were to do this. Nope. All right, so they're mining Source rocks. Saucy rocks. Oh my god, the new the new locations for loot have opened up thanks to Beast's armor. We could go back to the start of the map and play it all through again. Why would I want to go along there? I could walk along that ledge there. As if that was important. Oh, we had a key for that. Nice. That must have been on the dead worker. Nothing else? No, nothing else. Bring him back. He does look quite comical flying through the air like that. I should have my spirit vision on, shouldn't I? Let's talk to the um, archaeologist. Is this where he wants to be? The spirit taps his foot, arms crossed tight. Why are you wasting everyone's time? Get to the site before the Empress sees. And where were you digging? Haven't you seen the excavation site? There's real treasure there. Bones of the beast. The site's close. It has to be. There's more. I think this is what they're referring to. The spirit keeps glancing back. How can I help? Eh, uh, leave. Okay, we, there's nothing new offering there. Got my boys going down here. Oh, what's, what have we found? Whoa. What was that? Yeah, I was kind of wondering that. It does... For all I feel, you know, all powerful and almighty and stuff. Ah, okay. Something big and important over there. There's a lot of stuff going on in this cave. We check this way first, because 
Oh my god, this looks all big and all powerful as well, right. Watch those torches, fools. What are they up to? In here to tear this place apart. White Magisters. A weaponized monk. Right, there's going to be quite a fight down there. Holy crap, there's a lot of stuff over there. A lot of very combustible stuff. I wonder if I should start a fight with a with a fireball down into that thing. <laughs> well, better it blows up now than when I'm down there, eh? That's my thinking. Should we wait till that thing comes back? Or should I blow him up there? It was eventually a fight at the end of that. Hi, Fire Spy. How's it going? Oh, can I can I please do this? Um, I might do it. I'm going to do it on the one at the back in case it doesn't reach to him. But this is my super duper source trooper thing. And open fire. Did the lot. Nice. Oh, 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 that was good. We're going to suck up some some sauce from their corpses at the end of it. But that was super nice. So whether we were supposed to talk to them or not, I don't know. But it's not happening now. I think I'm going gonna, I'm, I'm gonna to save the high ground. I quite like it up here. Let's haste. Uh, beast would be a good one to haste, I think. He looks screwed down there, doesn't he? I mean, we have made a mess. We can't deny that. No, it's not Dallas. I first thought that was Dallas. But uh, it, it isn't. Oh, shoot me in the face, will you? I like, I like drawing them into a, a thing like this. They're getting sucked into another good AoE down here. Um, what have we got? We may as well use the high ground. Possessed Black Ring Reaver. Uh, I will go for you. And can I also get a, a ricochet on any of those? I think I can get him on him. That is 22 meters. 19 meters 20 meters i think if i do there it'll go twang 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 i'm gonna do that one he only got the two i thought it might stretch to him but sadly not i don't think there's much else i need to do there i'll save the point i'll get a three pointer attack off next turn Who are we on? Oh, I think a cursed fire demon summoned down in the middle of that would be uh, an absolute perfect addition to this little party. A fire infusion. Whoa, look at him. Look at him go. Isn't he a beauty? Let's boost his power up a little bit as well. In fact, let's also give him... Increased damage, set far sight infusion. There's no corpses yet to summon the bloated corpse from. Or the shadow infusion. I'll do the shadow infusion because that might be a really nice one. He is going to cause some serious hurt here. Let's go for the whirlwind. Yeah, that was kind of nice. Should we set someone on fire? Can I get all these three with a fireball? That would just be... That would be wishful thinking, I think. But I can get... I think he's the least of my words. I'll go for those two. Damn, that was good. 
Let me enrage beast. And then I can't charge all the way down there, can I? No. I can Phoenix dive. Oh, to there. <laughs> and encourage. I'll do some encouragement from there. That is one hell of a pet. Right, what have we actually got left to toast? Because it's kind of hard to see. That's dead. The dog doesn't look so good. Oh, this is this is Ifen anyway. I can do the summony corpsey thing. Because it's very cheap. It does physical damage though. Give me a target. I can't see. That thing's not dead yet. There's a Magister Knight. Um, I can't actually see a target here. Oh, of course, I'm being stupid. If I summon that, it gets rid of my, my other thing. Oh, well. Mr. Demon did his job, so... Gotta remember that. Gotta remember that. What have we got, then, that can do some nice work? I will... An elemental totem, I will put that in the fire down here. Just why not? And then, um... Enter. It missed. It, it, it missed. What a useless thing that was. Move over and hit him. Smack. And then shall I blow up? No, I'll end the turn. Because I think this thing's going to run in, and I'm going to try and get hits on both of them. Oh, it's dead? Oh, well, <laughs> Forget I said anything. A suitably sized chop. Fortify up. Oh no, well this one's going to come in. I'm going to see if I can get a physical damage on the pair of these two then. Which will be very nice. So you're enraged. Path is interrupted. Uh, if I'm very careful, I think I can kill her. Nice. Oh, I have another shot. Keep it coming. Can I crack all them with a fireball? That's not a fireball. That's a fireball. I might have singed my corpsey thing there a little bit. Everything's dead anyway. He shot my totem. I think the the AI do get attracted to attacking totems. So, you know, putting them down is a very valid, a very valid um, tactic. Can't see him. Two AP. Let's go there for two AP. Forget the fire. Let's teleport him. My thing dead down there. Yeah, it is. That's not a very nice place to be, really, is it? Mm, I'm not going down after him. Someone else can kill him. Why can't I see from there? Let's fly to... Hmm, okay. Well, let's fly down. I'll do the barrage. I murdered them. That was a brutal killing, and no mistake. Right, someone go back up there and check that out. And then we shall loot our way across. I need to wait for all this to, to go down.
A Magister's Cloak, Intelligence, Constitution and Air Resistance. That's not bad. That's not bad at all, actually. Mm, intelligence. Do you know what? It's a it's an it's not quite an improvement. Thirty hundred and fifty six. Finesse warfare and necromancer. I'm thinking I might switch that out. I lose a I lose a few points of overall armor, but I gain a nice boost to damage and health. And an empty slot. Let's have that. Let's have that on. On Fane. We'll go around looking like a magister. What should we put in there? Maximum physical armor. His physical armor. His physical armor is actually really poor because he's not equipping his shield for some reason. Right, let me give him some fire resistance. We'll, uh, we'll boost that up later with something else. It must have been some disease he had on. There, that's a big difference. I thought something was missing. When they get disease and their stats drop, they, they unequip anything that has a requirement of just under their, their um, stats. So, Yeah, if we can trick the AI into attacking totems and stuff with fireballs instead of me, that would be a, a lovely improvement, I think. Oh, uh, yeah, let's just loot these bodies, and then Fane has got to do a little bit of sorcery. I've got to say, I absolutely loved that fireball attack to start with. What is it? The um, Epidemic of Fire. That is very cool indeed. When everything's grouped up and not expecting trouble. <laughs> That's going to be my, my ambush weapon of choice from now on, I think. I didn't just suck that from the wrong person, did I? No, that's okay. Come on. Right then. Now that we are resourced, let's go and get some proper loot. I'm sure there will have been a dialogue bit intended for that. Before I, I blew the hell out of everything. Oh, nice. I, I need those big potions. Bread. The Alchemist's Workshop. What's in the box? Impressive. A barrel filling machine for the oil, I believe. From somewhere deep within the inner workings of the machine comes an irregular clanking sound, then a weak gurgle. Inoperable, it seems. Try the green lever. The machine churns into life. Gears rotate and pistons hiss from somewhere within its metal housing. It settles into a slow metallic chug, ready for the next... There's going to be a, a, a thing for this, so... We'll, um, we'll leave those barrels alone. We'll try and find some instructions. 